far, I am just ecstatic. I'm an animal lover. This is fitting. This is perfect. I'm having so much fun. We've only been here a couple hours. <laughs> What's up everybody? It is Vlogmas Day 15, the day of the honeymoon starting. And right now we are at Animal Kingdom Lodge, the Jumbo House Villas. And uh, so right now we are on the fifth floor of the main lobby. Our room is literally right above check-in. So they have like this nice little bridge over here that you could walk on. It's called the Maasai Bridge. So here's the bridge that you could walk on to get to the other side and all that kind of stuff. And literally the safari and like all that crap is out there. So there's literally animals right out there. You guys can't, can't even see me. But let's go check out the room. The room is absolutely insane. All right, so there's a room 2205 and we are walking in. As soon as we walk in, we have this nice kitchen here. And here is the foyer and all that kind of stuff. Here's the like the living room. This really, really nice table, comes with a TV, nice little storage area, nice table, my water from earlier, uh, little couch, I think this turns into a bed, uh, right there is the next room over, but literally, this place is insane, comes with a microwave, oven, sink, fridge, comes with everything. Okay, so we're going over here. Now we have our own washer and dryer and into the master bed. Look, there's Amanda. Hi, guys. And uh, so we have the bed, have the TV here. This room is super, super nice. Have some nice closet space. So there's more bedding in there. There's a safe. Um, let's see what's over here. Okay, so yeah, have like a little ironer. Um, so they have all this kind of stuff, like more uh, where you put your clothes at. And they have like a little USB charge port right here so I could charge my phone. Um, nice. It's really nice room. The best part is over here though. We'll get there. We have to come over here. I know, we will. I know. Almost. So, and then here's the, uh, the room. There's me. Hello. And on to the bathroom. So, have this nice painting of the Lion King, Timon, Pumbaa, Scar, and everybody. So that's really, really cool. The bathtub, man, this thing is so nice. And then there's the bathroom. And then, let's head outside. This is probably my favorite part. Literally, guys, literally, there's a zebra right there. Like a zebra. We had giraffes and stuff. There, you could, if you could see over here, uh, there's some more animals, but they're heading over. We can, we went down at the perfect time, and they were feeding them uh, over near that area over there. It's like on the other side of those buildings. But uh, yeah, so it's really cool that we got to see them like get fed. We saw some giraffes. We saw the zebras now. So this is one of my favorite hotels by far. This thing is unbelievable. Easily one of my favorite hotels. I have to say that so far I am, like my expectations have been exceeded. I of course was expecting a great hotel. You know, Disney always does a great job, but I did not know that we were gonna be able to see animals outside of our balcony. I didn't know that we had a separate living room and our bedroom. The bathroom is ridiculously cool. It has that painting on the bathtub. So, so far, I am just completely blown away. Um, we're gonna try some food later this evening. So, you know, we'll keep you guys posted on what we think of the food. Don't worry, I'll bring the camera. But so far, I am just ecstatic. I'm an animal lover. This is fitting. This is perfect. I'm having so much fun. We've only been here a couple hours. <laughs> okay, so we were just checking out some stuff on the table, and they gave uh, you this wildlife spotting guide. All the stuff that you can see in the safari from our uh, balcony. So there's a whole bunch of animals, like 
the African greater flamingo, the native birds, the American, the African spoonbill, uh, the blue crane, the northern ground hornbill. Uh, they have some uh, Somali wild ass, which is a donkey, basically. Uh, a zebra, uh, ank ankle cattle, giraffe, okapi. So yeah, they have like all these animals are on the um, basically the sunset like area that we have, the view that we have. So it's really nice that they did this. Guys, look at how close we are to them. Oh my gosh. There's a whole bunch like over there too. I know it's very hard to see, but there is a bunch of them over there too. They're all, e it's all eating time for them, so it's all dinner time. But they do have a campfire they're setting up for over here. So you could sit here. They're all getting it prepped and all that kind of stuff. A s'mores package. Make your own s'mores. One full pack of graham crackers and two full-size Hershey chocolate bars. So that's pretty cool, but yeah. So they are setting up for the uh, little bonfire out here. You get to see the animals. We might stop by, I don't know yet. Okay, so now we have ran into the zebras. And there's like some little uh, antelopes and there's some wildebeest over there. So you get to see those, but they're on people on a private tour right now also. But I think it's so cool that we get to see these guys like at a resort. This is definitely one of the nicest resorts I've ever been to. It's cool because these things here are little stairways to get uh, from each level. They have them on each side, so uh, yeah. It's a way to get around up on different floors. Okay, so now we are inside. Our room is literally like right here. So it's pretty cool that we get to see like the bottom floor of it now. But this is the Christmas tree for Animal Kingdom Lodge. It's really, really nice. Everything about this hotel is super, super nice, though. And then you have obviously the um, like the savanna view, but it's super, super, super nice in here. This also has a indoor campfire, basically. So if you like, you can come down and sit down if you want, and then just relax and enjoy the nice fire. Okay, so you're currently just like walking around the hotel, kind of exploring, and just walking down through one of the hallways, trying to find the fitness center, and these light structures are super, super nice, man. Like, the designs and everything. Like, that's super nice. This almost reminds me of Moana. So it's definitely really nice around here. So, 3,000 room. Oh, there's no fitness center, so we gotta turn around. Okay, so we finally found the gym in the fitness center, and this thing is literally like a legit gym. Have the treadmills over here, they have a whole bunch of machines in the back, they have free weights, there's somebody working out right now, but they have like a whole bunch of stuff in there, literally. It's like an actual gym. So, if you wanna get a workout in while you're on vacation, this is probably the place to do it. Okay, so here's the map of literally the whole Animal Kingdom Lodge. Right now, we are right here, but there is another uh, village. So this is the Kidani uh, village, and this is the Jumbo House. So, two completely different areas, and then here's the savanna, obviously. Our room is literally facing this way. So, we get this, uh, from what I remember, this is called Sunset Ridge because uh, my brother's fiance works here, so that's pretty cool. Uh, but yeah, so Kadani, Jumbo House. Just, uh, I think we might venture over here to see, what's, see what it looks like and everything, but this seems like it's the bigger side. 
We're also, to add, we are going to be eating at the Jico, Jico it's which is tonight. African food, and it's like their signature restaurant. So we're really excited to taste, you know, what this food is like because you know it goes with the theme, and it's African, and we're super excited. Okay, everyone, we are currently at dinner at Jico. I think that's how you say it in the Jumbo House at Animal Kingdom. I have gluten-free bread, which I'm very excited about that I get to eat bread. And then I have some lemonade. Zach just got this, is it a chicken flatbread? What is it? Okay. Tomatoes. And then he got a special bread that had this um, spread that has like honey in it, and it smells very sweet. Yeah, it looks good, I just can't have it. But we are currently on the appetizer portion of dinner and uh, we're very excited, I'm very excited. They have a gluten-free menu, so we'll let you guys know. So our um, waiter was just telling us that there's a hidden Mickey and he's like, good luck finding it. Literally two seconds after he got done talking about it, I found it, it's right there. Circle, circle, circle. Every, and then like everybody's like, man, that was fast. Okay guys, so I got the filet mignon. Ooh, I'm not good at pointing. Filet mignon, some roasted potatoes because of my gluten allergy, some tomatoes and onions over here, and a red wine sauce here to go with my filet mignon. Zach also got the filet, and he got, he took my asparagus, I don't like asparagus, but he also got some mac and cheese. And he has tomatoes and onions in there as well, and that's his filet. But so far, everything is delicious. What would you say? Very good. I love my little potatoes because of my allergy. And they put, you know, the sauce and everything is separate, so it makes me feel a lot better. Um, it's delicious. I absolutely love it. Crap, we made it back to this thing again. Curse, Amanda. It looks so good to eat. There's Amanda right there. Oh, she's not even focused. Let's get her in focus. There we go. But, hey, let's show this ingredients list again. Wow. 700 pounds of chocolate, 800 pounds of flour. Holy moly moly. This is how the gingerbread house is uh, constructed and decorated. So first they uh, measure for accuracy, then they assemble the house, applying the shingles, apply the shingles, and then the finishing touches. And then after all that, you get this. Voila! Okay, so we are getting on the bus for Magic Kingdom. But man, the dream lights are on. No, they're leaving. Magic Kingdom, you're awesome. We'll be back for you, don't worry. Okay, what is up guys? It is now like 11.30. Amanda's already been in bed for like two hours. I have to talk very quietly because she's in like that room right there. But um, yeah, so that was the end of our day basically. We didn't really, uh, we just wanted to explore basically. But the honeymoon has started, guys. The honeymoon has started, and tomorrow we are going to Animal Kingdom. It's going to be a lot of fun. We're going pretty early because I want to try and get her on Flight of Passage because she's never been on it. And then we're going to just go. We're not rushing anything, honestly. We're just going to have fun with it and just hang out. I mean, really, that's, that's the most important thing, just hanging out with each other and just having fun. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. This room is insane, man. Oh, man, I can't just wait for tomorrow. Tomorrow's going to be fun also. So don't forget to like this video. Don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you guys later.